call a supersonic sled that is something that we built that is just a very rich environment, lots of physics, it supports 3D vision, it's got tessellation in it, it's got just about everything that, that, that we can put into, into a game just to let people kind of experience what these next generation games are gonna be like. We're shipping this for free with every one of our, uh, every one of our GPUs so that our customers can have some, come some fun with it. So if you just, just to kind of get a feel, this is a, a rocket engine. This is, you know, his name is Barney, rocket engine. Uh, the rocket sled that he's, that he's on, he's kind of a nutty scientist guy. This rocket engine is just on the verge of exploding. It is, so, it's got so much power in it. Uh, the, the, the world that you see is, is very detailed, uh, detailed, um, uh, detailed modeling. We pause right there. So we just launched him up to the top. You can look around and see the world. The world is all tessellated. Uh, using DX11 tessellation uh, capabilities. Um, and, uh, and then if you drop back down to the, the bottom, Tom, this, this model that you see of the, of the rocket engine, it's all physics um, interacted. So every, every structure, this is a wireframe of the physics model, every structure that is in the, that is in the, the rocket engine here is being, the physics is being calculated on that, that structure. Um, so let's go back to the, um, uh, let's go back to, turn the physics off so every every structure is being physically calculated and the plume that you see is a is a full turbulence based plume so lots of processing going on and the whole idea behind behind super